Hey guys, so today when I was trying to load what seemed to be an impossible load uh, this morning, I realized that one of my brake lights was not working as you guys can see here. I decided to get this done today because when you are driving a commercial motor vehicle, the rules of, you know, the equipment is completely different. You can actually get a little big ticket when you are driving a commercial motor vehicle with a brake light broken. So. I decided to do this myself. Some people will actually consider taking this to a regular trader repair places, but you know, you don't want to waste money doing that. Um, this brake light was easy to pop in and out. As you guys can see here, it didn't take me any time at all to remove the, the light because the light has a rubber band around it. And I was able to pop that out in no time. And then uh, I actually went to Advanced Auto, that's where I got this light from. Before you go to look for this light, make sure you Google, because I tried to check AutoZone and I couldn't see if they actually even had any of one of these light because it's pretty specific to this trader. So I went to Advanced Auto and that's where I got this for $25 plus tax. And the Putting it together, it was pretty easy. I tried to use the, the rubber pen which came with the light, but it was too small. So I had to use the original one which came with the trader. This is a Texas Pride roll of trader. Uh, I've been fixing up a thing or two ever since I got this trader. I'm going to do a video down the road on my year one year review of the texas pride trailer roll off that i've been using for the last year if you guys gonna see more content on my youtube channel please consider subscribing to my youtube thank you very much for watching adios